Uh. Oklahoma has more than 400 dairy farms, but this 1,550-acre farm in McAllister is unique. It provides so much more than milk. I learned a lot about the farm life. This operation brings economic savings and job opportunity to the Oklahoma Department of Corrections. We provide 100% of the milk for the Department of Corrections. The farm is run by DOC's Agri-Services Division, employing dozens of inmates. They gain some ownership in them, so to speak, and uh, a sense of pride about themselves, and we hope that they carry that on out in the world whenever they discharge. When these men begin, they have very little livestock experience. Nowadays, the guys you get, most of them hadn't even seen a cow when they come here. Let's face it, it's a privilege to work out here. Cream of the crop. <laughs> I see what you did there, Lance. Yes, they are. But the inmates quickly learn every aspect of dairy farming. From birthing and bottle feeding calves. Twice a day, and it's fun. And the baby, you see them? <laughs> Meh. <laughs> they want their milk. To feeding. I kind of just whistle, whistle, and they come, they know, and when they see the wagon, they know it's time to eat. To administering medical care. They will leave Jackie Brennan Correctional Center capable of joining the workforce. It taught me a lot of patience into how to live life having a job and not hustling drugs or doing something I shouldn't be doing, sir. I'm done doing this criminal stuff. I learned a lot here. Just, I took this like a road tech and, and I'm going to use the skills I learned here to maybe find me a job when I get out. Beyond work skills, these men discover a sense of responsibility. It taught me how to take care of animals. It taught me how to be kind and responsible. They are required to milk the cows twice a day, every day. Rain, snow, or shine, so uh, these guys are out here doing their job. This prison farm produces 600,000 gallons of milk each year, with an average savings to taxpayers of 45 cents a gallon. That's, that's pretty good savings. Agri-Services contends the food and milk they supply also make the prisons a much safer environment. Food, or lack thereof, more importantly, is one of the leading causes of riots in the prison system, so we've got to go. The Department of Corrections is always looking for ways to save money, improve safety, and train inmates to be productive citizens. Cheers! Fair to say Agri-Services is milking this program for all it's worth.